So Ross, um, as one of our, as one of the senior players in the squad now, you've been here so long. Um, it's a big final. It's a big game on Sunday. You're looking forward to it. Yeah, I'm buzzing for it. I've been thinking about this this game for a while. I think it's been in the back of everyone's mind since the Kilmarnock game. So I've always wanted to play in a cup final with Rafe. So it's uh, finally time for it. And very obviously, um, you were around and about the squad in 2014, but you were one of the young lads back then. Um, this time, you've got a fairly good chance of playing, um, and it wouldn't have done you any harm uh, scoring an equaliser against Kilmarnock. There, Just talk us through that goal because you've scored a good few for a for a midfielder. Uh, I thought it was one of your better goals. Talk us through the goal. What do you thought of it? I'd probably, I'd probably say it's my best goal. <laughs> probably not hard. <laughs> I've not, I've not had that many good ones. Um, but yeah, just just remember picking the ball up around about the halfway line and I was probably desperate to pass it to someone but no one, none of the Kilmarnock players were kind of coming near me so I thought, why not just have a shot and obviously seeing it go in, it was, it was pretty special scoring a semi-final and then obviously after that even more special for Aaron Arnott to go and score his first goal for Rafe. Yeah. It was great timing for that. Oh yeah, you're obviously getting good in this at this interview thing because you've just second guessed what my next question's about. So um, you know, with you scoring the equaliser and Aaron scoring the winner, um, you know yourself, you're tw you're in your mid twenties now. But you are one of the more experienced guys. Um, what's it like to you being seen as a bit of a role model and a mentor to the likes of Aaron Arnott and Quinn Coulson and all the all the other young pros? Yeah, it's, bit, it's probably a bit strange. I've been here, well, I've been here so long now, but. It didn't, doesn't feel like long ago I was their age and then I had players like Liam Fox, Kevin Moon, Jason Thompson, all them that I looked up to and I, I still remember the players that were good to me and treated me well. I remember the players that weren't as well. So, um, yeah, I've, I try and do the same to them and uh, hopefully they can take bits from my game, other senior players, bits from their game and, and come on and hopefully be a big part uh, to the squad. And final question, added responsibility for you last Saturday, you were made captain up at Gayfield. Um, was that something you enjoyed, um, You know, starting the game as captain for the very first time? Yeah, it was a big privilege. Um, I was captain once before against Cowden Beef, um, and I think it was the League Cup. Um, but that was my, my first league game, so yeah, it's obviously I feel honoured to captain the club and since I've, I've been here so long it was it was a special moment just th obviously disappointed we, we couldn't win the game but um, I thought the the boys battled well and obviously disappointed just to lose those two goals when in a winning position but I um, thought for to go up there it's, it's never a pretty game it's always it's always pretty horrible um, but to score three goals uh, I've got to take positives from that Thanks for that. Let's get that positivity going. Thanks, Ross. Good luck for the final. Thank you.